truck is not like the Toyota Camry. When you just go in, lose the 21 or 22 boat, you yank it out right there. But uh, this vehicle is a little bit different to do this job. I'm gonna bring you along how to do this job. KGR, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. You know how we get done. If you're new to my channel, welcome. All we do here is sharing knowledge, sharing ideas. Please like and subscribe. And leave a comment down below also. KG, you know my slogan. Let's go. We're getting it, baby. So I'm going to do more explanation and show in the video as well. As you can see, for you to do this job, you have to take off the whole spindle. The problem with this uh, vehicle is this shock is different. It's the one that has the the pole goes inside the spindle so if you if you lose that uh this as uh what's that the boat right here 17 boats or whatever it is the the shock is not gonna come down by the time you pull this down it won't come down you have to lose the the ball joints underneath there i'm gonna show you guys in a minute and uh, once you do that you push this guy down right there then you can be able to pull it out. So I'm right, just gonna go out on top here and, and go to the shop right now. See right there and these shocks he has a he has a key right here so you have to make sure you line up with um all right let me let me bring the camera down so you guys can see the the spindle is right here let me try to turn it all right see the spindle is right here okay let me move this gotta lose the abs all of that okay you see right here See right here, uh, this curve right here. This is where that something goes in. Uh, I'll show you. Okay. Yeah, it sits right on top of here. Then the boat, this boat right here. And yeah, that boat. That boat comes right here, like this, to so lock it up. But you have to lose the ball joint without you doing that you gotta lose the ass so it's just a bunch of stuff you have to take up you know it's not an easy job anymore. a little pain in the ass to do it but uh it's doable okay Giotto, we're doing it so we're gonna bring the new one and uh, match it up and uh, we're getting this thing we're hanging it up kg so right. kg we're about to put back the shocks i just want to point out on these shocks right here you see it has a little key here so this is the setting right on top when you're going in. There's a little hole there. It has to go in that hole there. So we're gonna go back in there and uh, back see right on top right here see there's a key right there see right there that hole right there so that's where that what i was explaining so when that go in that hole then the the rest both sets everything is good so we're gonna come back here it's just i don't know how i'm gonna put the angle so Now we're gonna bring the spindle. See the spindle right there? I'm gonna bring the spindle, make sure. I'm trying to get a good view so I can get everything in there. Okay, so the spindle is right there now. So this one goes down like this. See? So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna go in right here. I'm gonna put the spindle yet though. Because we wanna try to get the shock in there first. That's what we want to do. 
We had the spindle in here first. I'm not going to video all this now. I might have to be blocking the camera. I have to block the camera. Okay, see that one? You gotta go. This, this guy gotta go in here first. Okay? Guy going there. See. So, you guys know what I'm talking about. So, that guy goes in there first. So, I'm going to pause the camera because I'm going to be covering it anyway. You won't see what I'm doing. KG. All right, KGR, the shocks is in now. So, I just want to point out one thing. So, you guys, when you want to do this kind of job, you see right at the back there. Uh, see if I can turn it. Uh, let me let me take out this camera all right bro. so this is what i wanted to point out see right at the back here right you see there's a slot here let me put the put on my put on my lights very well see there's a slot here you see that slot right here so that slot there that's where that the the, the structs there's a little pin there that goes on that hole there you have to make sure you line up if it doesn't line up, you can't get it all the way in. Then the shock is not gonna go all the way down. So I'm gonna show you on the old one, right there. You have to make sure you line that hole right there. Once you line it up, the boats will go in, everything else will go in. So I'm gonna show you from the old shocks. KGR, we're doing it. We'll right okay, back. you see exactly what I'm talking about? See, this right here, this guy right here, you have to make sure you line up on that hole there. If not, it's not gonna go all the way down. All right? I just want to point out, KGR. Okay, you see the reason why you have to take out those this? Because if you don't lose that, you won't be able to take out the, the, the strut, like I was saying. You have to lose the, the, the board joint. See? So you can press it down, and then you put it back in. See that? So without you losing that guy there, you won't be able to take out this. So. With those explanations, I believe. So we're just gonna tie it up down. Everything is in, the truck is in. We're gonna put this back. See the, the axle, everything is in now. So we're just gonna tie that again. So I'm not gonna show that, no one know. Cause I'm gonna be blocking the video anyway. So we'll be right back when I wrap it up. KGR. All right, so everything is snug up right now. Sweat bar link is there, everything. The tie rod put back the cali pad you know so that should be it everything is done i'm just gonna key it up right now and then that's it kgr we're doing it please like and subscribe i'm about to show my yeah, kgr so the job is done as you can see beautiful day in new york city <laughs> i'm loving it after all those cold weather so please like and subscribe to my youtube channel so this should be it on this 2016 on the accord is a spot. I just showed you how to do the front strokes. You just gotta follow the procedure. You'll be able to do it, be patient. Like, subscribe, share, leave a comment down below. Like I always say, I'm sharing my knowledge on this platform. That's what I'm preaching. I'm emptying everything that I know. I wanna empty it out on the surface of this earth before I exit. Like, subscribe, share. See you next time. Peace. I am out.